hello guys welcome to my youtube channel chemistry lovers today i am talking about a chemical reaction which is known as carbilamine reaction through this reaction we can distinguish the primary amine secondary amine and tertiary amine where only primary amine undergo this reaction and the product is isocyanide the mechanism is very difficult of this reaction but <coughs> Uh, so I cannot show the mechanism in this video. I only write this reaction on, on which the primary amine or secondary amine and tertiary amine can be synthesized so sorry can be distinguished from this so. This reaction is mainly done in alkaline medium and here the main reagent is primary amine which is substrate in the presence of chloroform. Here NaOH or KOH is used as a base and the ultimate product is isocyanide, alkyl isocyanide with nitrogen and carbon is connected with the triple bond and on the other side the alkyl group is connected with the nitrogen through single bond. So this group, this compound is known as alkyl isocyanide. The intermediate of this reaction is dichlorocarbene, which is an. No, I am previously talking about the carbene intermediate reaction. So here, the intermediate of this reaction is carbene, which is dichlorocarbene, and it attacks on the primary amine as an electrophilic attack, and through this, the alkyl isocyanide is formed. Here the R must be an alkyl group like methyl, ethyl and some propyl but it must be a primary amine because only primary amine can take part in this reaction. Neither secondary nor tertiary amine can react, can perform this reaction. The reason is that there are two active hydrogen present in case of primary amine but in secondary or tertiary amine there is only one hydrogen is present and ter for tertiary amine there are no active hydrogen present in with the nitrogen atom and as in this mechanism there are the replacement of active hydrogen take place in the form of HCl so due to the absence of active hydrogen in case of secondary and tertiary amine they cannot undergo this reaction while primary amine can undergo this reaction because there are two active hydrogen present in it. There is also a method of distinction between primary, secondary and tertiary amine where we can easily distinguish between primary, secondary and tertiary amine through this chemical test that is carbilamine reaction. So if you have any doubt regarding this reaction then you can ask me through the comment section given below and if you are interested to show the mechanism of this reaction then I will show you the next video and, up. and if you like this video then please give a comment press like button and subscribe my channel thank you